Oh, hello. Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from the Conservation Cookbook of 1918, we're going to be making a conservation sandwich. First thing we're going to do is blend equal parts butter to anchovy paste. Then we put that onto rye bread. Add a chopped up shrimp. We add chopped up cucumber and mayonnaise. Now it says to spread thickly on the bread. Okay, let's give this conservation sandwich a go. It's fine. It's not bad. The amount of the anchovy paste in here is very light. So you're just getting a little saltiness. It's not really overpowering of anchovy. So you're getting that salty butter. You're getting the nice shrimp, mayonnaise, and cucumber is pretty much non-existent. I don't know why they called for that little amount of cucumber for this, but um, let's plus it up, shall we? I'm going to use some of this Bobby's Boat Dust. It's got sea salt, organic tomato powder, chili powder, granulated garlic, granulated onion, ginger, fermented rice extract, cornstarch, shiitake extract, kombu extract, turmeric, black pepper, lime juice powder. It's tasty stuff. Okay, let's give this conservation sandwich plussed up with a little Bobby's boat dust. Ooh. So the boat dust is bringing a little bit of a depth of flavor, bringing a little brightness, um, and it's working really well with everything in here, and surprisingly, really well with the rye bread. Well, I gotta say, the original conservation sandwich was fine. Um, I had no problems with it. Um, it wasn't a wow sandwich. Uh, the use of rye was a nice change of pace. Um, I'm gonna give that a six, I think. Yeah, I think six. Uh, plus up with the Bobby's Boat Dust, that's gonna be like seven, seven and a half. I really enjoy that stuff and it works really well with seafood, and in this case shrimp, uh, and mayonnaise, and the cucumber, and even with the rye bread. So definitely gonna finish that. I would have the plus up version anytime. But if someone made me the non-plus-up version, I'd eat it. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow.